Hey guys, this is Rahul and you're welcome to gomahamaya.com and in this beautiful tutorial, we are going to learn how to configure PHP plugin in our website with just few simple clicks and it's completely a one click checkout page plugin. That's the demo we are going to see. This is, my, this is my demo website that we have created for demo purpose and you can see this is a normal card process but here you can see there's an express checkout if you click on this you can see a pop-up where you can easily write your phone number email id name shipping address and the coupon option and after this there's just a payment option if you'll fill all these details and if you'll say pay it will deduct a payment from your credit card and it's completely managed by stripe so let's get started now now we'll scroll down and and hover over the plugin click on add new in the search option you have to type peach pay and click on install now click on activate and here you have to click on approve and now you need to enter your stripe account so now we are going to create a stripe account from scratch once you are on the stripe.com you need to click on the pricing and then scroll down you'll see the pricing in your country uh, for uh, i'm from india so it's like issue uh, like for the cards issue in india is like two percent charges they want uh, for credit cards like outside india they want three percent charges like and there's no hidden monthly cost and all these things so i'll click on create account i'll enter my email id full name country and the password i'm done with everything now i'll click on create account now you need to activate the account first so i'll verify it till then i'll pause the video and now you can see i received an email for the verification you need to click on verify email address and now we need to click on activate your account then you have to fill the address here you have to select the type of business I'm an individual owner so I'll select an individual I'll click next and then add a personal details like name address date of birth and location and important part is I am from India so I have to add my PAN number I'll click on next and then you need to select the industry business detail you have to enter then you have to enter the support details then bank details then two-factor authentication and then summary final so i'll select here industry is software then website name is gomahamaya.com so i'll paste my website here and you need to write description for your products what are the um, i simply i wrote something to skip this step and i'll click on next here you need to enter your customer support detail these details will be there on the receipt or the invoice received by the customer your company phone number your description so that people they can understand like you can see in the right hand side corner what these things say and you can read it okay so my business name is gomahamaya.com i'll write it here and for a statement i'll write it as gomahamaya And here I need to enter my phone number like customer care phone number not your personal phone number and next for the bank detail you need to add uh, bank details here so my account name holder is on Rahul Kumar I already told you I'm a personal owner so everything is there on my name so let's fill this business detail I fill all my detail IFSC code account detail and confirm account details so i'll click on next and on the two step identification you can use google authenticator you can go to google uh, make sure these apps should be there on the phone this this app is there you can download in the phone and you can authenticate with stripe i'm already using on my phone but here i don't want to use uh, google authenticator because so it's better use some sms options so i'll write down my phone number this number should be your personal number to authenticate the account so click on confirm phone number now i received a six digit number on my phone number so i need to verify it and my code is one three 
2031. I'll click on confirm. And now, once in case you lose your phone or something happens, this is the code by which you can log in to a Stripe account in case you lose your phone or something happens. So download this one. You can copy it with the to the clipboard and you can send it to WhatsApp. You can send it to the email. You can store it anywhere you want. And this you should keep this code secretly. Anyone can access your account. Like if if you don't have phone number also. Like uh, so I'm not showing you this code itself. I'll click on done. You can add more options like Google Authentication also you can add okay but I don't want to uh, go ahead with the authenticator because this video will be too long. I'll click on next. So these are the details of your Stripe account, bank account and the address. Two factor authentication is there. Once you are done you should click on done. And you can see here I can find your account is active now. You can upload or customize your dashboard by clicking here. So there's upload option of your logo. You can send invoice to your client from this option. Share the payment link. And here are developers option like publishable key and the secret key you can find from here. Now you need to click on approve. And here you need to enter your email ID stripe email id i'll click on next and here you need to enter your stripe account password then you should click on login if you don't know how to create a stripe account there's a tutorial in the description box you can watch the tutorial to create a stripe account next click on login and there will be a verification code on your mobile to verify that you are the one who is making login. And here you can see my account get connected. Go Mahamaya is created on 21st July. Today itself I have created my account and you need to click on connect now. This is my business name, Go Mahamaya. And it's returning back to the Peach Pay. Now, docs are Peach Pay app success. You have successfully connected the Stripe account with us. We will send an activation key shortly. After you receive the key, you can enter in the PHP plugin. This is the activation code how you will receive. Davis at the rate php.app. You can send him the email if you have any question. You can even connect info at the rate php.app. And now you need to scroll down again and you need to find PHP. Here I can see Peach Pay. I'll click over this Peach Pay and then you could have received a Peach Pay activation key. So you need to copy this activation key. You'll receive the activation key instantly after some time itself. Like 10 minutes or 5 minutes within you'll receive. If you don't receive the activation key, you need to check with the Davis. This email ID, Davis at the rate peachpay.app. Or you can send a request on info at the rate peachpay.app. So I'll paste my activation key here and I'll select the language as US. You can allow the customer to use coupon at the checkout, enable the coupon, and you can use a test mode option. Like these are the test mode option. You can check these are the cards you can use at the time of checkout for the payment. So this card detail you can check to ch know whether your website is working fine or not with the stripe. Okay. And then there's option you can allow customer to upload a file. Currently I'm not choosing this option file upload and then email receipt. Send the PHP email receipt or you can generate your own email receipt. So I'll check this option. There will be additional email receipt. Okay. And next, there's option to customize your button. Button color you can select according to your website theme. Let's say your my if you go to my website, my website 
theme is almost sign you'll find yellow or blue so you can change you can choose according to that okay so i'll keep it till orange itself these are the designy part you can handle you can uh, burn position you can manage it you can width of the button you can width of the card page button button width of the card page you can manage from here it's all up to you left or right full center anything you can choose i'll click on save setting now we'll go to our shop page so let's visit our shop page so this is my store and almost things are sold out so you don't have option to buy things now we have only one option you have bottle or you have clock watch uh, wrist watch so i'll select the bottle i'm feeling thirsty after making videos now if you scroll down you can see there's express checkout mode so there's a one bottle I'll add it there and I'll click on express checkout. So directly you'll find the option. You can fill these details. You can apply coupon. The coupon is given by you to the customer. Okay. And this is completely managed by Stripe. Now, once you fill the detail, you have to click on continue. And this is the trial mode so i already told you there's a payment option like this this card number will going to work so i'll paste this card number and the, this will be the expiry date and month and next for cv is 444 i'll click on pay seven dollar now you can see it's processing the payment Thank you for your order received. The order number is this much, the date is this much, and the total value is this, and the payment method is Stripe Peach Pay. Okay, this is the thing you have ordered it, and you can see the Peach Pay have, pay have forwarded you email. Thank you for purchasing Rahul Kumar. Demo has this is a website name, has received your payment, and the order will has been placed shipping address will be this and the payment amount you have written everything will be there so i hope you find this video useful if you did give thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more further updates thank you